Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Susie and my channel is Light Fragments Oracle and I am so happy that you are here with me today. And I'm not blowing smoke. I really mean it. I really mean it. So I want to update you on a couple of things. I ordered my lights for my background. Just one strip of curtain lights. Thank you to... Uh, Deborah that mentioned that I could get curtain lights and so I got some twinkly fairy lights with the copper wire so that you just see the lights and not really the wire to put in my background so the mountains and all are in the background you can't see the moon but you can see some of the stars and then the lights will come down this way and I'm thinking that might help some of you that are experiencing a little confusion while watching me. But I just want you to know, if the bugs don't get really bad in the next couple weeks, I am going to be doing some of my videos outside. If I want to do a card reading or I want to uh, focus on a topic and not put on makeup. So you'll have that to look forward to. At least I'm having that to look forward to. Hello, summer coming. And the other thing that I ordered is the darker Max Factor foundation. It's called the Max Factor Miracle Touch Skin Perfecting Foundation with Hyaluronic Acid and SPF 30. Whatever they use in here for an SPF doesn't bother my skin. So I like that. Um, <clears throat> this is the color Sand 060. And I ordered a darker color. Because summer is coming. Because I liked this foundation so much. My weakness. Don't judge me. <laughs> and being the fact that I'm a content creator. I want you guys to be able to make choices for yourselves women men with mature skin to find what works for you you don't have to go out and purchase five or six foundations although in the past i have done that for myself and i didn't have a channel because i was always trying foundations and being disappointed so I can do that for you, but remember, we're all individuals, and our skin is different, and it's going to work differently for everybody, okay? But if you have a similar skin tone, if you have um, normal to dry skin, which is what I have, perhaps this would work for you. I have you know, some deep wrinkles, and I have some fine lines, and I have texture. So keep all that in mind when I do a review. Now, somebody asked me the other day in the comment section, what foundation would you consider the best so far? And I have to say that I love the LYS foundation. I feel this is an absolutely gorgeous foundation. It's more pricier than, you know, a drugstore, but this is an absolutely gorgeous foundation. Drugstore, Revlon Illuminance, gorgeous foundation. Um, I really enjoyed the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Treatment Makeup, too. I've only used this once or twice. I'm going to revisit this soon so more people can look at the video. But today, I think I'm going to put on Try the Micello because I prepped my skin. Let me tell you what I've been doing. This Mario Badescu skincare established in 1967 facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. This stuff is amazing. Look how much of it I've used already. Say I take a shower at night, right? And I put my skincare on. When I get up in the morning, I don't always reapply my skincare. 
I just splash water on my face to get, you know, to get my face hydrated. I pat it dry and I take this and I spray it over my face. This is what I sprayed on my face today. And I also used my hyaluronic acid from Joseph that Joseph sent to me. It's still good. It hasn't spoiled. Um, I don't know. Maybe in the future, I'll get a little miniature fridge and keep it over here in the corner on a table so that I can put some of my skincare in. So when I go to use it, it has that cooling effect. But that's all I've put on my skin today. Water, this facial spray, and my hyaluronic acid. Tonight, I will do my full skincare. But you know what else I've been using this for? You can use this on your body. I don't even know if it says that, but it says mist onto face, neck, or hair. I have used it in my hair. I've been using this on my arms. Check it out. This is what it looks like. Can you see the sheen? Mmm, it smells so good. I'm going to do this arm. Because my arms are showing right now. Not my legs, because it hasn't gotten that hot yet. But I did wear shorts one day when it hit 80. Um... So yeah, that's, you know, that's what I've been doing. You can take your hands and you can rub it in, but I'm just going to let it air dry. Oh, I ordered another foundation. I'm not going to tell you what it is. <laughs> I ordered it off Amazon. I saw a review on it. I read about it. I've never heard of it before, ever. And I thought, I'm going to... I'm going to try this foundation. It was only $11.49. It's just, it's an unheard of foundation. It's, it's not one of these viral foundations that goes wild on TikTok, on Instagram, on YouTube. And I think because it doesn't go what is that? viral, then, then people don't pay attention to it. And it's not a high-end brand that has the amount of money to advertise. And when I saw the review, I was like, holy crap, this looks like great foundation. So that's on order. That's coming on the 22nd. So Monday, I get my lights, I get the darker Max Factor, and I also, on Tuesday, I will be getting the other foundation. So look for those reviews. I'm not making any money on this. I bought it all myself. Yep, I, same with the Mario. I bought it myself. But you can get that at Marshall's too. I bought mine at the on the, one of the sales, either Sephora or Ulta, when they had their spring sale. I can't remember. I can barely remember day to day. <laughs> so when somebody asks me when I put up a short, what are you wearing for mascara? Or what are you wearing for eyeshadow? You know what, you guys, you're smart. You go into my channel, click on videos, scroll through the videos, see what I'm wearing in the short, and match it up with the video, and I will tell you. <laughs> but I, I can't be responding to, if I remember, great. But if I don't remember, I'm just going to scroll on by because I don't have that kind of time and I love to, to respond and comment to people. I do. But right now, I don't have that kind of time. Okay, let's move on. I just got my <clears throat> Timu order. Excuse me, I have to take a sip of water. The pollen is so bad over here, you guys. Look at my nose. It's red. That's from blowing my nose. The pollen is so bad. It's collecting on the vehicles. Whew. So it tick makes my throat tickle a little bit if I go outside, spend, you know, spend some time outside. But I got my Timu order. And I purchased the products. They did not give them to me for free. I've got to show you what I got. 
This is absolutely amazing. I bought these. I went by the reviews. They are true to size. As a matter of fact, these are actually a little bigger than true to size. Uh, I bought these white leggings. Now, these are like a spandex, but I got to show you the bottoms. Let me get it for you. The bottoms are lace. They are so pretty. So I tried them on, right? They come just a little bit above my ankle. They're supposed to be capris on women, but I'm short. So they come just a little bit above my ankle, which I love. The, the design is on the outside of the leg on both. Um, and then I tried on a, a, a blousey type shirt with these and really looks classy. Really looks classy. I've been wanting some of these because I saw um, Leanna, one of my content, she's a content creative friend. Uh, I consider her a friend. But I saw, you know, cyber friend. <laughs> I saw this on her channel. And I said, you know, now that I've got this space, I got to do some organizing here because so it would be nice for me to take out what I'm going to use ahead of time. So I purchased these. They came boxed up. The box was fine. It wasn't destroyed. This is to hold your palette. And I'm telling you, it's strong. It's strong plastic. Let me grab a palette and show you. All right, let me just grab this shadow kiss because this is what I used recently. So you can fit uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven palettes in here. And, you know, if you have, if you love eyeshadow or even, you know, you can, this is something else you can do. You can put your highlighter, you can put a blush. So I got two of them. I believe they're the same. Let me open up the other one just to make sure. But I believe they're the same. My husband just got home, so you're going to hear the dog barking. Okay. Yeah, I think I ordered two because I wanted to do... Uh, eyeshadow, yeah, th this is the same. I wanted to do eyeshadow palettes, and then I... He is majorly in love with my husband. Lucky loves me, and Teddy loves my husband. That dog will lay at the door and wait for my husband to come home. I mean... When my husband's not here and I'm here, he'll sit with me and he'll love me, but he's like obsessed with my husband. It's crazy. I'm a little worried because he's 11 and I don't know what my husband's going to do. I mean, that dog has been like a therapy dog to my husband, really. Okay, so yeah, I got two of the same. They're going to shine on you guys. So, yeah, I can put one, two, three, four, five, six, seven eyeshadow palettes, and I can rotate them. And I can use this one to put, you know, some blushes, some highlighters. So I'm, I'm stoked about that. And then I got to show you something else. This made my day. One of my subscribers from the UK, I'm telling you, I... I don't know what it is. Uh, maybe because my ancestry, my mother's side goes back to England. Uh, and my father's side goes back to France, terrain France. But I feel like I'm like, you know, like karmically, everything is evolving in my life. But I just, I just get on so well with the people from the UK. 
I, they, and, and, and like, you know, European people, um, people are way too sensitive here in the United States. I mean, you can be compassionate and you can be kind and loving, but the, but the oversensitivity stuff, it really kind of gets to me sometimes. And I can say that. I can say that because I'm a person that, that is super sensitive. But, you know, sometimes you have to get over yourself, you know? Like, sometimes I got to get over myself. Like, enough already. So, I get this huge package in the mail. I got to show you. <laughs> this is the box. It's huge. And a card. Let me read you the card. I asked her permission if I can mention her name. Caroline. Cameron. Thank you so much. Susie, to Susie, the biggest thanks sent to you for your kindness. You're amazing. Just a wee gift to thank you for your channel. I love it. And for doing the card readings. You are a gem. Sending much love from Caroline Cameron, one of your YouTube subscribers, XXX. And XXX right back at you, Caroline. This is the card. And... Remember I mentioned that I love the simple products that I got down at Marshall's? Check this out, you guys. <laughs> Check this out. She sent me a whole box. She sent me. She went out and bought the products because they're readily available in the UK. And I am set. I am set. You know... I don't have to spend my own money like I was selling a product. They were making money off of me, even though they gave me a freaking discount. Who shall not be named. But at some point, I will tell you that story. So, yeah, she sent me the eye makeup remover, the soothing facial toner. The Purifying Cleansing Lotion, which that one, I haven't seen this anywhere around here. That one, I, no artificial perfume or color, no harsh chemicals that can upset your skin, no soap, no alcohol, no mineral oils, no glycols, non-animal derived. And I'm going to tell you something right now. Um, I may send one of these bottles of the makeup remover... Um, and the bottle I bought of the toner to my daughter because I bet she would love this. She, this is also the soothing eye balm. This I'm so excited to try. It says, kind to the skin. It's a soothing eye balm. I'm sorry about the lighting. How come? There we go. My goodness. Um, yep, I'll be using this. And I, you know what? I'm going to use up some of the stuff that I have before I break into this. And let's see, what else did she put in here? She put me in a little... This is an eye mask with gel beads for me to, you know what this is going to do? Perfect for relieving migraines, stress-related tension, sinus pain, and heat exhaustion. This, this is going to, this is going to be great because you know what I would do when I would get a migraine or my sinuses were bothering me? I would take, I learned this myself. I, I take a long towel and I wet it with cold water and then I put ice cubes in it and I roll it up and I wrap it. So this is going to be like, Caroline, you're intuitive. Let's see. 
so that's it. <laughs> so much. Again, thank you, Caroline. You really, really blessed me. I had to get the other video done, and that was a lot of work. So I'll link it here if you haven't seen it on the, the fly curvy clothing. Man, you should have seen me throwing this off and throwing that off and throwing this off and trying to pull up. I haven't worn nylons or hosiery in years. <laughs> so I'm like, oh my God, I remember these days. <laughs> but it was so much fun. Going to be using the Misilo foundation again today because I'm going to try something different. I'm going to be using the Buff Beige for my face. I'm going to be using the Nude, which I purchased. They sent me this. I purchased this as a concealer. And I'm going to be using the Warm Sun from them as a contour. So this is three bottles of the same foundation. Okay, so let's put on the buff beige. I'm going to shake this. Okay, so I'm using two pumps. You can see this is not a very runny foundation. And, and I want to do one half of my face first. So you guys can see once again, now my skin is all prepped as I mentioned. So I'm going to put some there, some there, some there, and you have to work fast with this foundation. It does have a makeup smell to it, but let me tell you about this foundation. That's all it is. There's no skincare in it. It's strictly a full coverage foundation, which by the way, I like. I don't want my skincare in my foundation. I don't want SPF in my foundation. I'm going to buff this in with a foundation brush first. My brushes are clean. See, I, I'm talking and I really should not let this dry because it starts to dry very, very quickly. And that's the whole purpose of this foundation, by the way. The whole purpose of the Misilo foundation is to give you full coverage and to be a foundation. That's, that's it. That's its job. Now, if you are looking for that, right? then you may want to try this. That's a <laughs> The match on the buff beige is amazing. But because I want you guys to be able to see the difference, I'm going to go straight down my straight down my face. All right? This is a new company. And I believe that this foundation was designed for women that have rosacea and a lot of age spots that they want to cover Even up. Even if they've been working on getting the age spots diminished on their face, but they still show. I mean, look at You cannot see my age spots. All right, that's that's one half of my face. This is an amazing match. They do not have a lot of colors because they will send you like two colors, I believe, for the one price. At least that's the way it was when I placed my per first order with my own money and it wasn't PR. They sent me two bottles so that I could mix them. Okay, now I'm gonna go back just on this side and I'm gonna pounce in with my 
wet sponge. And I'm just kind of pushing it in. Now, if anybody asks me, is does this accentuate your fine lines and wrinkles? I don't even know what to say about that anymore. I'm going to be 64 in a month. Well, a month and a half. Okay. I have fine lines and wrinkles. I use my skincare. You know? Okay, let's do the other side. I'm not going to talk now. Now, at first, this feels a little tacky. This side is drying down. This side feels tacky. Mm, I probably should have mixed this with the lighter one. That's okay. I'm going to use my e.l.f. sponge to pounce this in under my eyes and also over my eyes. I will take a little bit more and go over my eyes like a primer because once this dries, it stays put. If you're the kind of person that likes a foundation to feel liquidy and dewy and barely there, this is not the foundation for you. But if you want a full coverage foundation and you want something that's going to stay put and not move, this would be a good foundation. I'm going to take the warm sun, which is really dark, and I'm going to use this as a contour. There is one darker than this. I'm going to be using the Milani Luminoso. Let's put some of that on. Let's use my nice, clean, enchanted brushes. I'm just going to go just above. Now that shimmer does, look it, I have texture no matter what. So shall I deny myself the joy of, you know, the color of this blush because I have texture? No. There's nothing wrong with it. This is why a lot of times when you become an older woman, you will see that younger women, they won't, they won't touch what you're saying with a 10-foot pole. And a lot of these younger makeup artists, even if they just like hit 40, but they're so used to being around younger models and things like that, they're not going to come to to my channel and say, that looks really nice on you. We understand that you're an older woman, but that looks really nice. That looks really pretty. They're not going to do it because you're not young enough. I know that sounds harsh. You're going to get, you might get 40, 40 year olds or 30 year olds or 25 year olds that just like you because they like your channel. But, you know, you're not going to get these makeup artists that are going to 
to come on to your channel, you know. Like, I have left comments on makeup artist channels, and they don't care. <laughs> so, I'm going to use a little bit of powder with this. You don't have to, but I'm going to. I'm just going to use my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Translucent Powder, and my puff, and I'm going to take a little bit of powder, and I'm going to pat it into the lid and I'm just going to press it. Now, you do not need to do this with this foundation, but I kind of want to soften things a little bit. People say, if you're an older woman, don't powder under your eyes. I'm going to powder a little bit on my eyelid because remember, I'm not wearing any, any eyeshadow today. I think I'm going to take a little bit of powder and press it around my nose. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm going to fix this. And you just, you know... Why do they put powders in these big, humongous... This is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. You don't use that much powder when you use it. You don't need it to be... They could cut the price down. <laughs> Some of this stuff is just... <laughs> cracks me up, to tell you the truth. Ooh, you get so much more product. Are you ever going to use it? There. I like that. Now I'm going to turn it around and I'm just going to go back one more time. You can even smooth it if you want, like, like this. Go back with the cleaner side underneath the eye to pick up any residue. And I'm going to put my mascara on and I will be right back. Nice. Nice. Now I'm going to have to crawl on my hands and knees to get that because I'm in such a small cubby. Since I have spent so much time doing this video, let's see. How much time have I spent? Holy crap, 48 minutes. Okay, everybody, here is the finished look. I just threw my hair up in a clip to get it off of my body. I had to take my Mario Badescu with paper towels and get all of that warm sun foundation out of my hair. I used my Revlon Color Stay Matte Lip Crayon in the color Sky High, which is a purple, because I'm feeling purple today, and these two colors look nice together. What did I do for my eyes? Well, I used my Il Ma Maquillage Eyeliner. And it's a really, really nice eyeliner. But the, this is the problem. Once you get the eyeliner on, go down closer to the eye, but not above. And it looked perfect, but then I said, oh, I'll just add a little bit more, and I messed it up. So then I ended up with this thick eyeliner line, and so I took a little bit of cocoa shadow and just kind of smudged it over it so that you couldn't tell that I made a mistake. So you can always fix it, right? But yeah, I kept it, I kept it just over, and I did do my eyelashes, but I don't know if you can see them. I'll get in close. I noticed that when I got in my magnifying mirror, I missed some powder. But this is the finished look. So if you're interested in the uh, Misilo foundation, click the link below. Click my link to get the code for 20% off. I, th I think that the uh, foundation is mid-20s. If you get two bottles, that's pretty dang good. And then you get 20% off of that. So, in other words, 
I believe they don't just send you out one bottle. I know that when I placed my order, I got two bottles. And then when they sent me the foundation to try, they sent me the kit, which is three bottles, so you can mix and match colors. But, yeah, I really, you know, I'm just set for the night. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm going to probably watch a movie with my husband. But I will be back tomorrow. And we will chat then. So if I don't get a chance to see you, uh, I'll see you when I see you. The next video. So be well, be blessed, be beautiful. Because you are because there is nobody else on the planet like you. You are here for a reason. Okay, my friends, dig deep. Heal that inner being and watch the light shine in your life. Until next time. Mwah. You know I love you.